it's just nice to know that there's somewhere to come and there's someone to talk to if I want to talk to them. But most of all, it's about being able to draw. And I always find that something's been put up on the wall. I'm really flattered by that because I just enjoy what I do. The idea was to look back at, at some sort of famous artists who struggled with their mental health in some way or another. Use those artists as a sort of start point, a jump off point really, for people to get some understanding of, of why they painted, what they painted, how they painted, um, how, how their life was, and their work was affected by their mental health problems. And to try and come up with a sort of contemporary take really drawing on people's own experience of mental health problems and, and their own artistic style and flair. Well, on the exhibition day we have a family morning here and my family come and they all sit around the table drawing and, and it's lovely, I enjoy the exhibitions. Uh, it's designed to be family friendly day so people can come along with their kids, uh, there'll be snacks and drinks there'll be an exhibition of some, some of the writers group work as well and some live music in the afternoons as well. This particular group is run by Mind and it helped to save me, I was in a bad place. It really helps, I find it, it's soothing. Um, you can out your feelings on the paper and I just, it's lovely company, these people here are just brilliant.